What is going on YouTube? Up and Adam here and today we have another Madden 22 video. In today's video, we're going to be going over how to get training, all right? The cheap training, free training, and when to buy to get this training. So before we jump into the video, make sure that like button, hit that sub button, turn those noti bells on for more Madden content. Okay, so because most feared release number two is coming out on Friday, training will be in will be in an interesting spot. We have seen training go up over the past week, week and a half. Normally it was around like 15, 16, 17, like just like around 20, but it's jumped up to about 22, 23 coins per training, which is quite high right now. And I expect it to stay around the same, but we are getting limited on Thursday. So at the time of recording this, it's Wednesday evening, but at the time of watching the video, we'll probably already be in game. So Justin Herber is coming out. Let me show you his card. It looks really, really solid. All right, so as you can see, Justin Herber LTD, 85 speed, 93 throw power, short accuracy is 92, mid 89, uh, deep throw under pressure. All those stats look really, really solid. And EA has also confirmed that he gets Hot Route Master. So the only other really good Hot Route Master QB in the game right now has to be Dan Marino. I know we have Tom Brady, but Dan Marino is like 75 speed or so. This is an 85 speed quarterback with Hot Route Master. This will be the best QB in the game until we get another card. But that's why I think training is going to be coming down on Thursday a little bit because a lot of people are going to be ripping packs for this card. So make sure you take advantage of trying to find cheap training because of this card. So I'm going to show you how to filter and what to look for when it comes to training. And I'm going to show you the prices right now. And then I'll show you how to get some free training towards the end. So stick around, all right? So here is the training uh, on PlayStation at the very moment at the time of recording. So you can see the cheapest training right now is going to be 23 coins per, right? So a 92 for about 230,000 coins. I do expect these numbers to drop a little bit while once Justin Herbert and the second LTD that I don't really know who we are getting yet um, come into the game. I think a lot of people are going to open packs. I think it will bring the market down a little bit. Will it really affect it that much? Probably not because people are still doing some rerolls. Um, for like the, the most feared and they're getting ready for most feared part two on Friday. So there's that, but I do think you'll be able to find a few snipes during the day tomorrow when these cards go into the game. So I think you'll find some of these cards for pretty cheap. Um, you probably it'll probably be around like the 20, 21 coin per training, but I'm going to try to stock up as much as I can because I do want to do some rerolls on Friday to test them out and see how they go. But make sure you are looking for cheap training. But yeah, the cheapest training right now is going to be these 92s at 230,000 coins. You could probably find like 91s for probably like 160, 170. Um, but yeah, these are just like the unfiltered prices on the market on PlayStation right now. Now, let me show you how to get some cheap training and how to filter down to get these cards for even cheaper than these prices that you see on the screen right now. Okay, let's head into the auction house. Let's go ahead and look through some. Now that we know what they all these overalls they sell for, they quick sell for, we can go ahead and try to look for some cheap training right now. Unfortunately, the team of the week did not move as much as I wanted it to. Normally, I would be getting 88s for about 45,000 coins, but because of everyone trying to do it, here's a 50,000, I'll take this one. But a lot of people who have been doing it, I missed out. So they haven't really dropped to the, the 50 to the 45,000 bars. They're about to 65, so... It's a lot more people are doing it this week. Training is still really, really high. We'll probably have to wait again until next week to grab these. So I'm not really looking at these team of the week anymore. What I do to look for training is I go ahead and go to my the name here. This is how I filter. I go put a uh, letter M and then I go by I go to quality and type elite and then I go by position and filter by newest. So we'll go to newest here. Uh, sorry, we'll go to the QB and then we'll go by newest and then we're going to see the price of some of these cards. You'll be able to find some snipes while just going through these. I get 87, an 87 for 57,000 coins, not good, right? You're going to want to go ahead and go by position, right? As long as you find them that are saying 59 minutes, you know these are going to be the newest cards on the block. Don't see anything too great right here. 
Uh, yeah, not not great. Not gonna lie to you. A lot of these prices right now are pretty high. I do think though, once the LTDs are actually in packs, I think they will be a little bit cheaper. I think you'll be able to snipe a little bit more. So try to use this. Try to use this filter right here once those LTDs are in packs, and you can grab some for a decent amount. Like right now, though, I'm not gonna touch anything. They are really really expensive. So go ahead. Grab your training at the cost that you're willing to pay for it. But I would say if you can hold off, wait until the LTDs are actually in packs and then go try to find some training at that, that training price. So 89s, you can look at the, another good way to look at this, you can look at the, the flashbacks. Uh, they were, they were, we got some new flashbacks. So sometimes those will be a little bit cheaper. You always gotta look. The biggest thing to find training and find cheapest cards is always going to look at what's new in the game. Whatever is new in the game and whatever packs we get, those are usually the cheapest cards at the moment. So we know that we got flashbacks to like at the time of recording, it's Wednesday. We got these flashback packs. So you can always, once these drop, usually people are opening them, trying to sell like the new cards. And then the older cards are kind of going for a little bit cheaper. So you can look at flashbacks, look at these um, most feared cards on Friday. Okay, they're going to probably go for quite cheap because people are going to be ripping rerolls for the new LTDs and all that. All right. And then when the, the LTDs come out with packs, there's gonna be a lot of new packs in the store and you'll be able to just, people are gonna just go, go ahead and buy or sell cards for really, really cheap because they're just trying to open packs and get more coins for more packs to open. So there you go. Team of the week was usually pretty good, but because yesterday uh, everyone still wants that, that training, it didn't really move too much. So another thing that you can do to make some coins right now is building this Justin Herbert uh, team team builder you can go buy those 81s sorry the 80s and some golds for like you could probably build this set for about like 20 23,000 and I think people are buying it for like 40,000 right now I don't know I haven't really sold one just yet but I've been people have been telling me that you can sell it for quite a bit yeah it kind of kind of went down I'm gonna list it up here for like 33,000 I built it for like 20 so any kind of profit here is not too bad in my book anyways that is going to be your best bet in order to find training. I know, I know training is a little bit high. So, but the thing is, if the training is that high, then you're selling cars for higher. So it's okay. But that is how you're going to want to filter. It's going to, this is a, a, a shorter video. I just want to show you how to get that, that cheap training. And here's a way to get some free training. I know it's, it's not a lot, but there still is a little bit of a way to get free training. If you go ahead and do your new team of the week, solos this week number six you get um, an 88 end cap and you can quick sell it for 280 training is it a lot no it's not a lot but it still is free training so if you go ahead and look at one of my old end cats i haven't done the solos yet on on this account but here's here's an 88 end cap from last week the debo samuel i can quick sell it for 280 training you can pick either uh matthew wright or the cd lamb again if you want to keep it obviously go ahead and keep it but you, if you don't need that card at all, quick sell it for the training, take your 280 training and use that training to open rerolls or power up cards, things like that. But there you go. There's a little, little tip on how to get some free training. But the main thing is always when you're looking for training, see what the new content is because usually the new content is what is going to be the cheapest on the block. So just a little pro tip for you. So when LTDs are in packs, a lot of cards will be cheap because people will be ripping for them. And then on Friday with most feared, look for most feared cards because those are going to be a little bit cheaper because people are going to be opening packs and trying to get the new cards. All right. So there's the tip for the week. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure that like button, hit that sub button and turn those noti bells on. And I'll catch you with another video very, very soon.